You and Missy looked like you were having fun today. Uh, yeah, we were. A little father-daughter bonding. <laughs> hey, it was nice. You guys were out there for a while. What were you talking about? Oh, well, you know, just life. Sure. Everything okay? Everything's fine. Nothing to worry about. You're really not going to tell me? No. Hey there, Sheldon. What can I do for you? I'm wondering if you have any books on stopping bad habits. A few? What habit are you trying to stop? Science. Yes, sir. It's not permanent. I'm just looking to take a break. I've heard that one before. What did you take a break from? Happiness. Okay. I've tried a few different activities, but whatever I do just leads me back to science. Well, let's think about it. What's the opposite of science? Science is based in facts, and the opposite of facts is fiction. How about fantasy? Magic and dragons? We have a whole section here. Ooh, that sounds intellectually bankrupt. I'll give it a shot. I found a way to take a break from science. That's great. What is it? A fantasy book series called The Lord of the Rings. Well, it's got the Lord in it. That's something. That one had some zip on it. Zip's a good thing, right? Yes. So it looks like I know what I'm doing? Just like a pro. Well, like a lady pro. Oh, yes, very much. Is there anything else good I could say about the Rangers? Uh, let's see. Tell whoever's interested that no one's ever gonna touch Nolan Ryan's strikeout record. Because he strikes out all the time. No, because he throws strikeouts all the time. Oh, big difference. Dinner's ready. Five more minutes. She wants five more minutes with her old dad. What are they doing out there? They're bonding. It's great. Sheldon, how's your book? Nice pivot. Excellent. There's a character named Gollum who was corrupted by the Ring of Power. Now he runs around naked and bites the heads off fish. That's called sushi. Which, by the way, I will die before I eat. Speaking of dying, when you do, can I have your car? Please refer to it the Prancing Pony. He says that it's mid year stay shire year 1418. However, in Appendix B, it says that Gandalf met Radagast on June 29th, which is impossible because. Hey! Next time it's my shoe, and I will put Zip on it.